excited. Like I said, I say this every video. I'm excited to see where Rainbow High is going to go because they just keep stepping up their quality. And welcome to the doll circle and thank you so much mga for giving me finn for free to share with all of you today so he's the last one from the pacific coast line we have all of the dolls now and i have reviewed all the other ones and the pool play set as well so if you want to check those out go right ahead and like i said he's the last one in the series he is going to be available now at most retailers i i'm excited about him i like the i was gonna say snowboard oh my god what a long day the surfboard <laughs> that he comes with and he comes with cute little glasses i like his color motif and i definitely like his little like fanny pack is so cute like i just love that he's so cool honestly i really like him this is series one of the pacific coast doll line for rainbow high in case you're not familiar you haven't seen them but yeah i've seen them popping up at a lot of stores now i feel like most retailers like i said have these i've seen them at target especially um he's the last one though to be able to be in like stores so he's like the last one to come out in stores so let's get him out of the box i know you've already heard me talk about the other ones so let's get him open so he can go hang out by the pool with the rest of the dolls okay so he's out of the package he's so cute he has these beautiful hazel eyes i really like his hair here let me take off his can i take off his hat here i can lift his hat up look it's blonde to pink ombre and then has beautiful curly hair on the top Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, do you see that? Can you guys see that? So he's shedding a lot. Maybe I won't rub his head. Okay, that's a little weird. I don't know why it's doing that. But his hair is cute. It's curly and it's ombre, but it does shed. So if you're going to keep him, maybe he won't wear dark colored clothing or something because it is shedding a lot. It should stop. Most of the time with any doll, like when you first get it, if you brush it out a little bit, it gets some of the loose hairs out, but he's very shuddy. That's weird. Uh, hmm. Interesting. It's okay. I feel you on the balding. Okay. <laughs> I do like his hat though. It's really cute. It's actually basket woven style with rainbow high. It honestly it makes me think of Bella. Like, I feel like this would go with Bella really well because of the pink and the RHs on it. And like I said, it's actual basket material. Like it's not printed on fabric because these are about $32 and they are not coming with like a ton of extra outfits or stuff like that. Now the whole thing with the Pacific Coast Lines, they come with extra feet for the ones that wear heels. Obviously this one does not have that option. He just has his own feet with articulation in the ankles instead of the extra legs like I have here as an example for the female counterpart to the Pacific Coast line so they can wear heels or flats. I would like to see him rock some heels though. I'm not going to lie. I think that'd be really cute. I like the sh swim shorts. I was going to say shorts, the swim suit, the shorts. It has multiple, oh, it's a different, oh, it is different fabrics and it does tie in the front and it says rainbow high in all these different fonts all around there with gold on it. That's really cute. I love his little pack, which is Velcroed on. Yeah, his little pack is Velcroed on, so it just comes right off. And underneath it reveals, it says sparkle, but it's also like a cut T, like a split T. So one side says California, the other side says sparkle, is supposed to say sparkle. I mean, again, let's be honest, Pacific Coast, it's throwing a little shade to another doll line that lives in that area. <laughs> I'm not hating it though. I think the font is really interesting though. That is definitely giving me 90s-esque font of another doll line as well. And honestly, I don't hate it. I love a little shade. Why not? You know, and this bag, <laughs> is it real? The bag is real. The bag zipper actually unzips. It's real. That is such a good detail. <gasps> He's like, what can I say? What can I say? <laughs> I've got the details. The zipper here, it's so cute. That actually is a real zipper. Okay, what other doll line has that? Even at a $32 price point. His little shoes are all colored to match. I like that so much. Underneath it does say rainbow on the bottom of his shoes. And this one doesn't come with a towel. It does come with a stand, which is in a pink, almost like a coralish pinks like salmon colored it's kind of salmon colored okay that color it doesn't come with a towel and the rest of them come with their towel or handbag so i feel like out of all of them he kind of comes with the least amount of things because he only comes with a surfboard and sunglasses versus the other one comes with i feel like more stuff but the surfboard is really cool it's plastic but really sturdy though it doesn't feel like flimsy I do like that it is double-sided rainbow on one side rainbow all over on this side I even like the detail that look it's velcroed or elastic 
velcroed to strap around his ankle so he doesn't lose his surfboard that little bit of detail because most doll surfboards and i've had them before you know from other companies and it's just like a piece of thin plastic this actually has fins on it you can tell it's weighty it's not just like a thin sheet of plastic cut into a surfboard like it's an actual surfboard with the little loop on it to hang on his ankle so he's not going to lose his surfboard when he goes on the coast to go swimming and like i said it does come with a stand which did i already mention that yeah i did i don't even remember what i talked about and the last thing he comes with is really cool sunglasses that actually it's supposed to be like like most designer brands or like ray-bans or whatever has like the name on the lens I don't know if it can be picked up with the camera here, but it says rainbow on the lens. And I like that it's pink and white. It's detailed. The lenses, you can see through them. I hate sunglasses for dolls when it's like molded and it's all pink, all purple. I'm like, I get it. It's inexpensive, but also I'm like, come on. Like the, the real lenses make a difference on these dolls. And let's put these on and let's see what he looks like. Oh, he's ready for the beach. He's like, let's go to the beach, beach. Let's run away. <laughs> like, I love this. He's so cute. He is really, really cute. And again, the color scheme is so perfect for him. I feel like it looks really good with his skin tone. I love the, like I said, the hazel eyes and the lashes really cute again not as much accessory wise as the female dolls that have you know like the extra legs and a towel and stuff like i would like to him come with a towel because he's at the beach but honestly either way so much detail especially to me what's blowing my mind is the zipper on this handbag like so god if they all their handbags are coming with zippers on it even more because i think they have had a couple with zippers on there if i remember but so cute honestly i really like i said he just feels so good like he just feels like a good weighty doll and for 32 bucks i'm not mad at it i like it mm -hmm. and now he's like i said he's gonna go to the coast with the other dolls and hang out by the pool <laughs> oh my god i have his shades on thank you so much mga for being so amazing like always <laughs> and giving me this for free today to share with all of you on this review like honestly like i really think they're cute they they could have just done a simple budget swim line you know they could have just put them in swimsuits very simple no bags no accessories and had them for like 15 bucks right but i feel like other doll lines have done that with this, they're giving us, yes, a swim line. Yes, they're going to the beach or at the pool. But, like, look. Like, they're giving us the, you know, woven hat with the zippered bag, with the glasses, with the detail, with the lenses. You know, the shoes with colors on it, not just one molded color, you know. Like, even down, like, again, I'm not a surfer, so I don't know the technical name for the strap here that goes around your ankle. But it's giving us, like I said, something extra. And that to me is such a big thing when you're looking at a lot of dolls and things like that. So, <sighs> all right, let me know in the comments below how you feel about Finn, the last doll here I'm reviewing for Pacific Coast. I'm excited, like I said, I say this every video, I'm excited to see where Rainbow High is going to go because they just keep stepping up their quality. And yes, their price keeps going up, but I feel like they keep giving us something for that. So I'm happy about it. All right, until next time, make sure to watch more content from me. I got some links in the description below. Follow me on Instagram. I try to go live on there when I can. <laughs> you know, I try to post stuff on Instagram more and I have a TikTok, which I try posting doll stuff on there too. So let me know what you think about Finn. And like I said, until next time, bye. <laughs>